like an ultimate recycling project. A live report from our Butte studios with our John Amy with a fascinating story of what one company wants to do with Berkeley Pit water. John. That's right, Donna. It may be hard to believe, but the dirty, toxic water of the Berkeley Pit could be used as a clean energy source. And one major company is in talks with Butte about possibly making it happen. Butte is continuing its talks with the Mitsubishi Hitachi Power Systems for a potential project that would convert the toxic water from the Berkeley pit into hydrogen that would power the city of Los Angeles. They're calling it probably the green uh, coal strip right here in Butte. While still in the beginning phases, the company proposes to build a plant at the port of Montana to convert the pit water into hydrogen and then transport it down to a storage plant in Utah via a pipeline. Green energy has a lot of potential for Butte where if this were to move forward, there's going to be a lot of other companies that spin off as a result of it. The Port of Montana Industrial Park, just southwest of Butte, is getting attention from many other industries. The infrastructure's there, the land's there. Um, it really has the ability to leverage some bigger deals, and we've seen a lot of interest in it. And you can't escape the irony that the most toxic body of water in America could potentially become an environmentally friendly source of power. It's cool. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I think that's one of the potentials that's really exciting with this is the ability to, yes, use the outflow of the Berkeley pit and turn it into green energy. Now, city officials don't have a timeline of if or even when this project will occur because it is still in the beginning phases, but they say it is a positive development for the mining city. And that's the story from Butte reporting live. John Amy. Back to you. Very interesting. Thank you, John.